Hello everyone, so today I'm going to do the Colors of the Rainbow tag, and I was tagged by Cassie Shades of Cassie and Davida Anaida 1976 so I will leave a link to both of those lovely ladies down below, so thank you guys so much for tagging me. So this tag is pretty self-explanatory, basically I'm just going to share some of my favorite products pertaining to that particular color that corresponds to all of the colors of the rainbow. So let's begin. The first color is red, and I have two items to share with you, and the first one was definitely a no-brainer for me. The first item is Tarte's Amazonian Clay Blush in Natural Beauty, and this is a beautiful, beautiful strawberry red. And this color will definitely work on anyone, no matter what complexion you may be. It's just a very natural color. You can definitely share this out, even though this is quite pigmented. Do not be scared of this blush. It just gives you a really, really natural flush from within sort of glow, which is absolutely beautiful. The next red item I had to mention because this has quickly become one of my favorite lip colors and this is a Rouge Bunny Rouge lipstick and this is one of their color burst lipsticks so it's a little bit more opaque and this is in the shade Word of Mouth 013 and this is a gorgeous gorgeous red it's not intimidating whatsoever it's not bright or bold it's just very natural and it gives you a really nice sheen so I will do a heavy swatch and then a lighter swatch so this is a heavy swatch and then this is a lighter swatch. So this is the color that I have on my lips right now and it's just a beautiful red and I can wear this every day. I just, I love this color. The next color is orange and I have a body butter here and this is from Herb Garden Naturals. This is the Orange Essence Body Butter and this is just phenomenal. This smells like heaven, it smells so citrusy and it just smells like fresh squeezed oranges. It's amazing. And this is actually made from a local company here in the state that I live in. So double bonus. And uh, yeah, the packaging is orange, but the product itself is orange as well. And this is just so emollient, so hydrating. It's just one of my favorite body butters, and I just, I had to show it some love. Yellow, another no-brainer for me. So, I had to mention my little three musketeers. I use these products every day, and they are all yellow. They are definitely staples in my makeup routine, so... Of course, I had to mention them. So the first one is the NYX HD Concealer in the shade Yellow. And this is a pale yellow concealer, and it just helps to brighten up those under eyes. I use this before my foundation, of course. And it's just a great, great, great concealer. I love it. The next one is the Benai Banana Luxury Powder, and this is like a setting powder. I use it as a setting powder. Some people use it just to kind of brighten up their under eyes as well and just kind of set their concealer. I use it as a all-over face powder, and it really helps after my foundation sets to just apply it on top of my foundation very lightly, and it just really neutralizes my face because some foundations can tend to be towards the pinkier side and using this just really helps to neutralize the entire uh, look. And then uh, the last item is my Jane Iredell Lid Primer and this is in the shade Lemon and I love this eye primer. It just really helps to brighten up my eyes, neutralize my lids, and it helps to keep my eyeshadows in place all day. So love all those products. So those are my favorite yellow items. Next color on the list is green, and I have two items to share with you. The first one is the Alba Botanica Natural Very Emollient Cream Shade in Coconut Lime. I absolutely love the scent of this. It smells like a pina colada. And I also love that this is great if you have dried legs like myself, because it leaves a very cooling, refreshing sensation after you shave your legs. I'm not sure if this has any peppermint in it or not, but it does feel that way, and I really love that because it really does help to kind of soothe the dryness in my legs. So, really love this product. The next product that I wanted to share with you is the I Dream of Genie Trio from Wet n Wild. It just has a beautiful array of greens. So, I really thought that this was appropriate to share with you. So, these are the green shadows. So, I will swatch them. You have a really nice 
pale green it's quite shimmery and then a minty green and then a lime green so those are the colors they are very springy and beautiful blue of course it's what I have on my nails right now this is Orly's Royal Navy and I've had this color for such a long time every time I wear this color everyone always asks me what's on my nails and I get tons of compliments it's just a beautiful beautiful blue it's not too dark it's not too bright but it's it's definitely noticeable and it's just such a gorgeous color it has hints of turquoise shimmer in it as well it's just such a stunning color and this is definitely by far my favorite blue nail polish and blue is just my favorite color to wear on my nails so uh, it was just natural to uh, share a blue nail polish with you guys for the blue category and I absolutely love this one. So the next color is indigo and that was kind of a hard one for me. I don't really own a lot of things that are indigo. For me indigo is between a blue and a purple and it's just like a mashup of both of those colors so I came across this eyeliner from Prestige and I have used this quite a bit this is in the shade Masquerade and I will swatch it for you and to me this would be the color indigo and I really do like this liner. I use it on my lower lash line and it just really makes my brown eyes pop. And uh, I definitely I definitely would recommend this liner if you like colored liners. But I don't recommend the Prestige eyeliner line as a whole. But this color is definitely gorgeous. So the next color is violet. And violet, or purple, happens to be one of my favorite colors. So I have a couple things to share with you. The first thing is from Tarte. And this is the Pure Maracuja Oil. Now of course the oil is in purple, but the beautiful bottle is. And I just, I had to mention it because I love I love my Maracuja oil. Uh, it just has really helped to improve my dry skin. This has been part of my nighttime routine for over two years now. So I really, really love my Maracuja oil. The next thing is from Ilamasca. And this is a blusher in the shade Morale. This is gorgeous. If you like bright, bold blushes, this is a great one to have. Whether you have pale skin or darker skin, this is just gorgeous. It all depends on how much you put on your cheeks, of course, but you can definitely blend it out and it's just so pretty. It has an amazing sheen. It's just, it's a stunner. The uh, last Violet product is this lipstick that I've talked about so many times this is from Stila it's one of their color bomb lipsticks in the shade Gemma and this is basically along the same lines as Ilamasca's Morale but it's basically in lipstick form so there it is it's just it's gorgeous if you love your purples you will love well both the lipstick and the blush they're amazing so they're just an amazing duo actually if you wear them together gorgeous so those are my favorite violet products the next color is pink and I have a couple random grooming essentials here that happen to be all pink so these two are actually from Ardell and these are my brow groomers now the first one is what I use to kind of shape up the outer edge of my brows and just give it a little bit of a form so I love this and then I use this little guy for my unibrow right in the center of those two brows I just kind of clean up that area so love that and then of course this is pretty self-explanatory but uh, this is from Persona and these are all cruelty free of course and Persona is cruelty free and this is the twin blade plus so this has uh, two blades if you can see that there and it just gives me a really nice smooth shave I've never uh, I've never gotten nicked by this blade at all 
it's just a really nice blade and I love it so amazing so those are my favorite products I know pretty random now the last item that you have to mention either has to be rainbow colored or multicolored, and I don't really have anything that's rainbow colored so I went with multicolored and I chose my tweezers as you can see they have a couple colors on them not exactly the colors of the rainbow but uh, I love I love my tweezers they are just super cute and they work really really well and I get mine at uh, Sally's and I have a bunch of these all over my house and uh, yeah, I just I really enjoy them and I don't hear a lot of people talking about them and they are way better than tweezer mints and way cheaper so double bonus I hope you guys found this somewhat entertaining and I will tag a couple girls down below and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye guys!